Hey everyone, uh, today we'll learn how to create SAP transaction code as a desktop software. This video is more helpful for business users or SAP end users who will be repeatedly running the codes on their daily basis. Say for example if a user uses FB50 transaction code on his daily basis, so he has to go to FB50 and then you can find the option up here which says generate shortcuts. So click on generate shortcuts. SAP standard provides two different options. One is your desktop and one is your SAP logon pad. If you click on SAP logon pad, it will create a shortcut in your GUI logon pad. If you choose desktop, then it will create a shortcut in your desktop. Let us see both of them. So I'll choose SAP logon first and then click on finish. So if you go to SAP logon pad, you will find the thing here. So I'll just close this code. Simply click on this. So it asks for password, so I'll put the password in. Actually, you want to type the password, so it. Now we'll see the second option which says to your desktop. So click on the same thing here and then I'll change the to your SAP logon to your desktop. So you can click on the desktop shortcut. So in the same way you can create uh, multiple tickets with your desktop shortcuts that depends upon uh, a user like how many times it will use it. So when you click on this, it simply ask for a password. Okay. Alright okay. guys, um, that's for today. So if you like my video, please hit the like button and do share as much as you can so that uh, this, this video is going to be helpful for the business users and do subscribe as well. Thank you.